Here we go then. Let's play the free radio music game. Jane, this morning, the score you need to beat set on Monday by Rob was six. Okay, it's quite high. It's quite high. Pair of tickets to the Genting Arena. (laughs) It could be Sting and Paul Simon. You could be going if you get the highest score of the week. You've got one minute of questions about the music we play on free radio. I do have to take your first answer. If you're not sure, you can pass. Just get through as many as you can. Okay. First question, though. Guess the year. Here's a clip of a song. I need to know for a point each. The artist, the title and the year that this was a big hit. Here we go. I heard he sang a good song. Who is it, Jane? The Fugees. Yes. With? Uh, the Fugees. 2007? Oh, no, it was 1996. What was the song? Killing Me Softly. Yes. Right, in 2000, which UK artist became the youngest male to write and sing a UK number one with Fill Me In? David. Yes! Uh, in 2002, Beyonce had a song from the Austin Powers Gold Member soundtrack. Which song was it? Beyonce. Oh, Austin Powers. Oh, pass. It was a pass. It was called Work It Out. Uh, which American state did Paloma Faith sing about in 2009? Paloma Faith. Paloma Faith. Um, American. Oh, pass for a minute, pass. Oh, it was New York. In oh. which country was Cliff Richard born? Cliff Richard was born in... Oh, Barbados. He was born in India. Mm-hmm. Right, who were the first group to have the three debut singles, including Crash the Wedding, enter the top three in ascending order? Tricky question. Ah. That was busted. Uh, who duetted with Peter Gabriel? We're running out of time, so I can't give you that one, but go on, just for the sake of it. Who duetted with Peter Gabriel in 1986 on the song Don't Give Up? Gosh, I've gone brain dead, but I, I know who you mean. I can't think, honey. It no would have been Kate Bush. It would have been Kate Bush. Yeah, no problem. Oh, All no, right. no, I would have got it wrong. You scored three, <laughs> which any other day would have been a really good score, but it's not as good as Rob, who got oh, six. Was it rubbish? No, it wasn't rubbish. I'd never say that, Jane. <laughs> what was it? You're a star.